What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. For those that are new here, hi, my name is Rochelle and I like to make thrifting and fashion videos along with a little bit of beauty and just sharing my life with you guys over here on my little corner of the internet. For today's video, I'm really excited because I am doing a hair tutorial. A lot of you guys ask me whenever I show pictures or like have my hair styled like this, how I do it. So I figured I'd just give you guys a really quick tutorial. There's a ton of people on the internet that have already done this, so I'm not like reinventing the wheel, but you guys always ask, so I figured Whenever you guys ask, I can send you just the link to this video. All right, you guys, so this is my hair with no hair extensions. I wear hair extensions probably like five days a week. So I was really excited to do this hair tutorial because I just got some new hair extensions. These are from Amazing Beauty right here. Um, and these are 100% human hair. I only like to use clip-in hair extensions because I like to take them out at night. I like to sleep with just my natural hair up in a hair tie and it just bothers me to have them in like all the time. I will link these hair extensions down below, um, but they just look like this. In the past, I have had very ombre hair extensions. So darker brown at the top and then like lighter, really light blonde at the bottom, but I felt like these kind of like highlighted blonde ones would just fit my hair a little bit better. The only thing is these ones aren't dark at the root and I do have a pretty dark root, so hopefully they will be able to be concealed within my hair. So first thing I'm gonna do for this hairstyle is clip in all of my hair extensions. <laughs> I just wanted to show you guys really quickly too, in the extensions, you do get a really pretty little like satin case for when you carry them or when you're like going on vacation or something like that. And then they do give you a really nice little hair clip here and a teasing comb. So here's the weft at the top. And then here is the other side where it has the two clips. I'll turn around so that you guys can kind of like see what I'm doing. I'm just taking the two clips I just pull a little hair and clip it down. It's super easy. Just like that. So here's with the hair extensions in. Like I said, I feel like these ones just kind of like match my hair color at the moment other than the tops. I do have to be a little bit careful with the top showing through since I do have a darker root. Maybe if you guys like this video, you guys would like to see how I dye my extensions at the top to make the roots kind of blend in better with my actual hair. Let me know if that's a video you want me to do in the future because I can totally do that for you on these extensions. We're gonna start heat styling our hair. So first off, I'm just going to use this IGK Good Behavior Protein Smoothing Spray. It looks like this. It just really helps my hair stay nice and smooth and soft and it also is a heat protectant. So I like to spray it on the extensions as well as my real hair because I feel like it helps the extensions stay smooth and softer for a longer period of time. Honestly, I usually get about a year out of one pair of clip-in extensions. That's how long they usually last me for. Kind of depends on the brand though. Some brands are better than others and I've never tried this brand before, so we'll see. To get the mermaid waves, I like to use a triple barrel. It looks like this. They have so many of them. They also call them like a deep waver or a triple barrel iron. This one I got off of Amazon. Um, they have one from like Revlon. I will link it down below. I think it was like $25 or so. Don't like to be too precise with this hairstyle because I feel like the more precise I am, the more it doesn't look natural. And I kind of like it just to look like very like tousled and natural kind of waves. I feel like that's the whole point of this hairstyle. I don't like to go very high up near the root of my hair. I always try to start like an inch or two after the base of my roots. So maybe like that. And I don't leave it on for too long either, just a few seconds and you just move it down. Super easy, you guys. On the next ones, I'll kind of do it more at an angle, just so when my hair is all laying down, it kind of like goes in different directions, if that makes sense. For any of you guys wondering, these extensions are the 20 inch extensions, and I personally got the ones that weren't so thick, so I think this was like 160 grams of hair because I have pretty thin, fine hair, and sometimes I feel like if the hair is too thick, it looks 
not as natural so I like to get a hair that's like a little bit more fine because I feel like it actually looks like it could be my hair I feel like you can grab a pretty big amount of hair at a time as well when you are doing the triple barrel you can grab bigger sections so it's a really fast hairstyle I also feel like it's easy to sleep on your hair this way and it still looks good for like a few days after you heat style it. Sometimes I'll just like touch it up in certain spots but I feel like it is a good style that will last quite a while. Alright you guys, and I always like to tease my hair a little bit just because I feel like my roots are always really flat and it also does help conceal any of the extensions in case anything is like peeking through on those lighter parts. So I always like to just go in on the very top of my head. I make the tease bigger and then kind of comb it out because I feel like if you just do it to the perfect amount then it always just like falls out. So I always try to like overdo it. Like this. <laughs> And then just lightly run your comb through. This part needs another crimping. I absolutely love this hairstyle. Whenever I wear my hair like this, you guys always ask, so I feel like you guys like it as well. I feel like it's just very effortless and it looks like my hair naturally is just kind of like has a kink to it or just has like a light body wave, but it definitely doesn't. I have very, very fine hair. doesn't have any sort of bend to it. It looks like I have like light mermaid waves and it's so natural and easy. I love my hair like this and I feel like you guys really like it as well because whenever I wear it, you guys always end up like asking me questions about it or complimenting me on my hairstyle. I like that it's really easy to redo the next day. I just run my little iron through it in the places that need a little bit of touching up. Super easy. And I feel like it only takes me a few minutes to do my hair like this, like under 10 minutes for sure to have me clip in all of my hair extensions and actually deep wave the whole everything. So for a really quick, easy, effortless hairstyle, I absolutely love it. Let me know if you guys want me to do a video where I dye the roots of my extensions just to give it kind of like that deeper color like my natural hair is. I can definitely do that for you. It'd be very easy to show you guys how to do that and just kind of like customize your extensions if they don't have like the perfect one for your hair. Just kind of like a darker root. That'd be really fun. But that is it, you guys. Here is the final product. These are the 22 inch hair extensions from Amazing Beauty. I will link everything in the description box down below if you guys are interested. You guys always ask me about like hair, wigs, extensions, all sorts of questions like that. And yes, I wear hair extensions all the time you guys if my hair looks longer it's extensions <laughs> all right you guys i love you guys so so much i'll see you guys very very soon in my next video bye